love pepperoni pizza. Whenever somebody says, how many calories this meal has? So I don't, you know, it's just every time I, you know, I, I see comments where it's like, I just need to just ignore them, I know, but every, you have to agree, every single thing I eat, every single thing I put in my mouth gets highly scrutinized and it annoys the shit out of me, quite frankly. So I just wanted to show everybody my skinny ankle. Um, my ankle is skinny, so yeah, there you have it. Yay! Wowie. Number one, yes, comments are turned off for now because I just don't want to hear it. I know how they get when I do mukbangs or anything I eat. So for now, I'm just turning them off. It's not going to be forever. I don't know how long. Whatever. I'm at. Whenever I feel like turning them back on, I guess. <laughs> All right. It's, it's not that I don't have a thick skin. I don't have a thick, annoying tolerance. Annoyance tolerance. So we have some Daisy Duke wings, which are barbecue with medium sauce and dry mango chipotle. We have some dry, um, dry hang em high wings, which are dry southern heat and dry jerk. Celery carrots, <laughs> the obligatory side veggie. Um, and they didn't give me enough. I ordered a bunch of ranch. They didn't give me enough, so I need a refund on that. Then we have some pickle willies, which are deep fried pickles with a creamy dill sauce. And some seasoned french fries. Yes. Mm. And I wanted to diet Pepsi, but they gave me Pepsi, so whatever. First I'm going to try these Daisy Dukes. They're my favorite. With the blue cheese. Give you a beauty bite. I'm really hungry, so I need to dig in right now. <laughs> beauty bite! So, <clears throat> I'm going to be doing a whole week of mukbangs. Like, every day. Mukbang of my choice. So every day, you're going to be getting a mukbang and story time. For a straight week. I was... I don't know. I was bored, desperate, feeling a little frisky, like I wanted to talk to somebody about something, something. <laughs> oh my, I look really skinny today. So don't worry, guys. I look skinny. I'm good. There's a seasoning, there's a spice in jerk. I just love. Mm -hmm. We're talking. And then he says to me, you know, I like a big girl. I like to do a big girl, is what he said. I'd like to see if I can handle it. Hey, princess. Can I have sex with your fat rolls? <laughs> I'm sorry, but my rolls are not exactly an erogenous zone, so what's in it for me? But I, I never learn. I keep going back. And there was this guy. Legit serial killer. Like, every single person I talk to on there, I think, is it serial, ki serial killer? So I look for signs. Chantel from Ottawa was a lonely 36-year-old woman just looking for a good time. Tragically, her head was found in a sewer just 27 miles west of her hometown. Wow. Well, this guy was super pushy. He was like... And I wasn't attracted to him at all. At all. Yeah, so he messaged me and like I accepted, he had messaged me and like he didn't want to talk. Like I don't like a guy I can't have a conversation with. Like who just doesn't care about what you have to say. Like almost instantly he was like, let's meet up and go for coffee. Can I find out more about you first? Like what if I, what if I don't like you? What if I don't want to meet you for coffee? Like. Tell me something about yourself. Give me something, you know? So I said, well, can we talk a bit first? We'll talk when we go for coffee. I'd really like to wait a little bit and get to know you first. It's just coffee. So I block, I uh, didn't block him, but I un like cut the communication with him. He tries to get back in, like, by liking my profile again or whatever. However Tinder works. Like, swipe right, I guess. Oh, 
Oh, well, I've had enough food. <laughs> I really liked the deep fried pickles the most and the Daisy Duke wings. Those are my favorite. The carrots and celery were pretty good too, but I'm stuffed. I mean, I'm high enough to eat.